you had a, a chance to sit down and watch Saturday's game and, and analyse what went wrong? Yeah, obviously we were watching the game, talking with my staff, uh, watching the game with players and uh, analysing what was wrong and then especially trying to uh, train and to be on the pitch uh, trying to correct these things. So after every game we have this uh, kind of analysis but in this case because you don't have too much time you play against against the same team. So we have been practicing on the pitch and trying to fix the, the problems. I said uh, after the game, so we started the game making mistakes, giving the ball away, easy passes. And we knew that could happen if we were doing these kind of uh, uh, passes and then we are carry on doing the same. And then we can see the, a goal that changed everything because uh, you, are, you have to push harder, you have a little bit of uh, anxiety, uh, the fans are expecting the team uh, reacting and then you have... Uh, more and more problems because you make uh, you make more and more mistakes. You mentioned the expectation there, and do you think perhaps when you have a win like you did against Queens Park Rangers, the supporters are all at the game, everyone's happy, looking forward, and, and expecting goals, can that weigh heavily on on the team? Yeah, I think that from from the start, from the beginning, when I just arrived, <coughs> I tried to to say what I have to say that is the best for the team. So consistency. Uh, on the pitch and consistency in the message I think is important so I said after the Queen's Park Rangers game that uh, plenty of room for improvement and people said mm, but you can see that it's still uh, we are a team that has to improve has to manage the games uh, a little bit better but also it's the same for everyone here so for us for the staff for players for the fans we have to realise that every single press conference I say <coughs> tough uh, competition, difficult, every game, but that is true. So it's not that we are saying that because we have to say that, it's that the reality. But this reality, we have to to be sure that we understand what is going on, the fans, they understand what is going on, the players, they understand what is going on. And then if we work hard together, if we are united like our name is saying, it will be easier for us. So I think it's a consistency. If I uh, said after the QPR game, oh, fantastic, we are the best in the world. You could say, oh, maybe uh, it's not true and it's just uh, too much uh, positive. But what I said is we can improve and we saw the other day that we have to manage better uh, these kind of games. Especially now we have a situation that at home that we are stronger than the other teams. So in this case, we have 70% of possession, but we are not creating too many chances. Why? Because the other teams, they work hard, they are organised and they know what to do. So we need <coughs> the team uh, with the right mentality, and I think that they, know, they knew because we were talking about that, be careful with the overconfidence. We need the fans with the right mentality, supporting the team and uh, with us. And at the end, it will be easier and we can celebrate together. But it's the time, I think, to realise that uh, it's not just a... Uh, we say in Spanish a military uh, path, or I don't know how you say in English, so we have to work hard, and we have to work hard every game. How do you say in English? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so when the army is, uh, is a parade, a parade, a parade, it's not a parade, so we have to work hard every single game. So, But uh, we know that. My message is always the same, and I think that the majority of the fans, they are happy because I don't carry away, oh, you know, fantastic, so then they have to have the same uh, feeling. We need to support the players if they give everything because that is the key for us and uh, they have done. So I saw the reaction of the fans at the end of the season. It was amazing. A team was relegated. It was amazing. I can see or I could see the reaction of our fans this year and it's amazing. When you go away, you can see the difference. So then we have to try uh, to support the players because they can make the difference for us. The fans, they can make the difference for us and we have to be consistent, doing well or not so well. And so we'll try to put things right now on the next game. It's probably always good to have another game so quickly, but especially one against the same opponents. No, I mean, it's especially in this league, um, you know, after you've had a bad game, you always get a chance to put things right pretty quickly. Um, but no, obviously we played them Saturday, we've got to play them again on Tuesday, so, um, you know, it's a chance for a wee bit of revenge. Have you sensed a real determination on the training pitch that people do want to put that right? No, it is. It's, um, 
you know, obviously the main focus here is promotion, so I mean that's the main push. Uh, you know, our season isn't got to revolve around getting our own back in Wolves, but you know, it's a chance for us, uh, you know, personally to you know put put uh, right that wrong that, um, from Saturday.